today means to me. It means a lot to me because it signifies an important part of my life because I can predict transition from a child to a young person. It is so special to have everyone here to acknowledge and appreciate all the hard work that I've done to reach this day. My bar mitzvah day is important to me because all of my special family and friends are here to watch me sing and recite all of the great prayers and teachings that I've learned over the past several months. This day also shows me that I can do anything I put my mind to and that I am becoming a more responsible part of the Jewish community. I would like to recognize and thank again all of those who have helped me reach this special day. Thanks, Mom and Dad, for all that you do. Your unconditional love and support will, con will continue to give me strength as I grow into adulthood. Thanks, Dad, for always motivating me to be the best that I can be and for dealing with my all but wonderful teenage girl news. Thank you for also encouraging me even when I don't score that perfect test grade, which rarely happens. And Mom, thanks for always being there for me and teaching me that almost anything can be done while singing a song. You've taught me to work hard for the things that you want and to appreciate the wonderful things in life that you already have. Thanks, Brian, for always reminding me to practice my Hebrew and for always standing by my side through life's ups and downs. No matter how much we argue, just know that I will always be there for you and that I love you. Thanks to my friends for all your support. And Dee, thanks for being such a big and special part of my life and for teaching me that Tori Birch isn't just a person, but also the name I want on my shoes. Thanks <laughs> <laughs> to my aunts, uncles, and cousins who have come here from far away to see me on this special day. Thank you, Cantor, Debbie, and Lisa for being the best Hebrew teachers ever. And thanks for having classes at Dunkin' Donuts so I can have a latte with my lessons. I wouldn't have been able to do this without you. I would also like to thank all four of my amazing grandparents for being such a huge and loving part of me growing up. You're so special to me. Papa, thanks for the special times fishing and hanging out on your boat. Thank you for also teaching me that almost any stressful situation can be cured with a beautiful sunset at the Jupiter Inlet. Omar. Thanks for always giving me incredible tips, whether it be for shopping or for life in general. Your determination to succeed in everything you do inspires me to do great things. Fair new pop. Thank you for cheering me on at chorus recitals and for capturing all the special moments on the camera and video. Pa, I love it when you bring back great memories as we have around your TV watching old family videos, especially when, when it entails Grammy's amazing home cook videos. Thank you also for continuing to show me that Judaism holds a special place in my heart. Its beautiful customs and beliefs will guide me through no matter what path I take in life. What do I pray for? I pray that I will grow up to be a successful and valuable part of my community. I pray that one day, when I have a family of my own, I will instill in my children the same love and values that my mom and dad have given me. I pray a lot for my family and ask God to keep them healthy, safe, and happy. I also pray that the people in Israel and everywhere in the world will find peace and contentment within themselves so they can appreciate the value in life instead of destroying others. My family has planned a trip to Israel next summer. My hope is that Israel can find peace soon so we can enjoy her extreme beauty instead of her seemingly endless pain. And lastly, I pray that this dear God didn't bore you too much. Thank you for being here.